Yes. A little bit. <laughs> this never gets old, ever. Love it. Our director loves it too. But now, <laughs> she wants to look at this all morning. <laughs> What's she saying? Why well, you want to do it again? I know, right? You want to do it again? Now let's see how well he does with the hornets. Oh. He is live at UC Davis. Where Please, he's out. these are wasps, people. Come on, these are wasps. Look oh, at all those. those. Uh, okay, it, it is amazing. When I was when I was when they told me I was going to do this segment, I was like, oh, entomology and art. Uh, this is kind of interesting. I am blown away, and this is absolutely amazing. So you're taking the the home of the wasp, yes, and you're turning it magically into art. That's right, I am. Now and it it. it I thought that this would be so delicate that it would fall apart in your hand, but the wasps really do a good job with it, don't they? They do. It's surprisingly tough material. It has to go through rain, it has to go through wind storms, it has to go through predators, so it's very sturdy but very lightweight. Very lightweight. Now, you, you got an example for us right here. We wanted to see how you do it. Here's a sheet of the wasp paper if, after the wasps have made it, and, and that's what it's all made of. And what I do is I take it off of the nest and I apply some glue to a surface and I just press it down like that and there you have it. It's almost got like a, a Van Gogh effect. It does. Like little tiny brush strokes or something. Yes, it looks like a painter has dipped a brush into multicolored paint and just swiped it across the surface. It is so cool. Okay, would you guys at home like to know the science behind what we're looking at? Yes, you would. Uh, Steve, please explain to him. Okay, so this is the, the wasp nest, and we see all those lines. Now, what are we looking at? Yeah, so each one of those colored arcs that she was talking about, that represents the trip of a single wasp to go to a fence or a dead tree, chew off a little bit of the bark, macerate it, and then lay it down in a very... Um, colorful pattern to us. They don't really care, but we see the beauty. <laughs> we in see it. the beauty in it. Now, don't think that Anne is throwing out wasps and making them homeless. Uh, only one wasp will survive a year, right? Well, the, yeah, each colony like this at the end of the year will put out a number of queens, and the queens are who will survive. The workers and the males, they don't make it through the winter. So this is actually a, a condo or an apartment building for many thousands of wasps. It really is fascinating how that turns into art. And thank you so much for telling And Steve, very nice to meet you finally. It's called It's Bugged, Insects Roll in Design. And I'm telling you, it is absolutely fascinating. We got the information on the screen. Very nice to meet you. All right, back to you guys in the studio. Fascinating. Yes. Wasps, not hornets. There mm -hmm. is a difference. Yeah. There is a big difference. Mm -hmm. Cool.